Hey, it's Sam on Here's to Us, and we spent three days here at Menominee, Michigan. Really a great marina, and we are going to move on over to Sturgeon Bay. It's a distance of about 22 miles, and let's go. Yeah, we were docked right here by the, on the wall, by the m, &M Yacht Club, and going in the cockpit just because the wind is a little fierce this morning so I got a boat pole ready for whenever we flip around okay you got plenty of room back here in the back to go you know to the sailboat where that sailboat was parked behind us Do you want me to go to the front and look at that, or can you see? Sam said he can see in the front okay. It's just in the back here where he's trying to turn around. So we were in that slip right there with that sailboat. He's just taking it nice and slow. We've stayed here three nights. Really fantastic marina. The best boater, boater's lounge I think we have seen. And the showers are nice. Really nice marina to stay. If you do decide to go on the western side of Lake Michigan. Well, I don't know. It's a big boat too. A big boat's out there. Aiming this way. It doesn't look like they're slowing down, so we will. Maybe they're going into that first uh, first docking, but I don't know. It's hard to see from this angle. This is Menominee, please shift to 7171. This is Menominee, go ahead. Uh, yeah, we're, we're going to stand by here. I saw you coming out, uh, so we'll stand by to let you come out. Over. Okay, thank you very much, sir. Back to one six. Looks like he's just staying in the same place there. It's gonna wait for us to get there here. Right across the way here is Marinette, Wisconsin. And right back in there is where they make giant Navy ships. We took a walk over there to take a look. It's just an incredible operation that they have. <laughs> but Wisconsin here, Michigan here. Hey, from the bridge of the Here's to Us, uh, we are about uh, an hour out. However, we have a couple of challenges here. We have two bridges, and one bridge opens on the hour and the half hour. And the next bridge, which is just behind it, opens on the quarter hour and the three quarter hour. So it's kind of a 15 minute wait in there. So we are adjusting our speed because I know about when I'm going to get to that bridge. And so I've just pushed up the speed a little bit to get there within a minute or two. And we can always go a little bit faster if we have to. So first bridge that we're going to come upon is 13 feet 8 inches so we definitely have to have that open because we're uh, over 17 feet so uh, we'll be giving the bridge a call as we get up here a little bit closer there are a few ships they're building here or working on here in the area it's a giant setup Roger Blau it looks like we're coming up to Sturgeon Bay see these giant ships being worked on here on the left. There's two bridges that we're coming up to. Trying to get the 11 o'clock opening. So it's 11 o'clock. We are going under the first bridge. Cars are stopped on both sides. 
of course. And um, it's our turn now, Michigan Street Bridge. So now we're gonna pull in here and wait 15 minutes for the second bridge to open. That'll give me plenty of time to get the fenders and the lines ready. Because the marina is just right on the other side there. Um, Sam thinks we can get under it. We should probably find out how, what the clearance is. But it looks, it doesn't look like we need it opened. Well, I had 20s on the top. So, and there are three lines under it. It's hard to tell. There's no other number on the board. Well, we have to wait 15 minutes. We got through that bridge and now we're waiting for this bridge. I have the opportunity of getting the lines ready and putting all the fenders out. But you know, it didn't take that long. Now that I'm a trained professional. So I got my fenders ready, got my lines ready, and um, we still have, from the time I finished, I'd say we still had about nine, eight, nine minutes left to wait. So we're gonna wait a little bit longer. Fishing boats have it made here. No problem, no waiting. But us and that sailboat, we're turning circles around each other. traffic arm started clanking so he's stopping traffic right now must be a minute or so before 11 15 here they go Queen Street Bridge Do you see the marker over there that has 20 on it? At center, it says 20 at the top, and then it shows marks under there. So 19, 18, 17, it's below 17 feet, and we are about 17, six. Actually a little higher right now because we do have the two antennas up on each side. So we couldn't have made it under there. I had to wait patiently for it to open. Did I mention patience is in our strong suit? Oh, well, we made the best of it. I do appreciate the time I had to uh, get the lines and fenders in place. I still love going through bridges. We haven't done that in a very long time. It's just so cool looking at bridges from underneath. Because you usually, you know, in your daily life, go over them, but not under them. Very cool about doing the loop. Thanks to Mike and Sue for lending us their car. And we're going to take a trip up the west side of Door County and then down the uh, east side of Door County and see some places that we didn't get to see. Couldn't see them all. We did get to Fish Creek, but we're going to see the rest of them by car. So we are on our first stop on the Door County Tour here, and we have come up Route 42, and this is Egg Harbor. Beautiful. Looking out on Green Bay right now. We are here in uh, Founders Square at Fish Creek. Fish Creek, probably one of the quaintest little places here to visit in Door County. Lots of shops and things to look at along the way. 
So in the village of Ephraim in Door County, nice little harbor here, seems well protected and plenty of places to anchor out there and explore the little town of what we see is a population of 288. A little bit bigger than Egg Harbor, which had a posted population of 201. Here at Sister Bay, which has a population stated of around 800, much bigger place. And you can kind of see it is a huge bay where you could anchor out here. A couple of marinas. Beautiful day on Green Bay. So still in Sister Bay here and had to stop at this very colorful place with the yellow umbrellas and grass on the roof of all the buildings and yes they are goats up there but they're not real goats they had me fooled actually one of them may be or they have some animatronics in them because that one just moved so the goats up there are real and I thought it was an animatronics, but you could see them moving. And one of the locals here said, yes, they are real. So here at Ellison Bay, a real tiny little place, a private marina here. But it looks like you could anchor out there. Just a beautiful day again on our Door County tour as we go up the coast. Here we are at Gills Rock and not much here, just a small marina, smaller boats in here. But it does look like it has some protection out here if you wanted to anchor. And we still have a ways to go to get to the tip of uh, the island. We are at Bailey's Harbor, now on the Lake Michigan side of Door County. See Lake Michigan out there, and there's a harbor in here. Old private marina. Hey, thanks for coming along with us on the trip from Menominee over here to Sturgeon Bay where we took a tour of Door County and got to see a lot of places. Fabulous place out here in Door County. Highly recommend it. See you next time on What You Have to Do.